got another guest here with us today. Uh, he's a member of the European Parliament. And anybody who's watched anything to do with the Assange case, or indeed anything to do with progressive politics whatsoever, will know that there's no better fighter, no better spokesman than Mick Wallace. How you doing? It's great to see so many good people here. It's great to see that there's so many people that care. In the European Parliament, they talk morning and noon and night about freedom of journalism, freedom of expression, human rights, humanity law. But you know what? The press is creeping with hypocrisy. They don't give a damn about journalists when it doesn't suit them. The treatment of Julian Assange exposes the Western countries like nothing before. Over nearly 200 journalists have died in Gaza. They don't give a damn about them either. They only care about journalists the way they have them in their pocket and they do what they're fucking told. The pressure, the pressure pollution and the attempted extradition of Julian Assange is all about stopping the truth. Because they don't want the truth to be out there. Because they behave badly. They're still behaving like colonialists. Their mindset is still colonialist. And that too has been exposed in Ukraine and in Gaza. Western imperialism is still on the march. And Julian Assange had the audacity, the audacity to expose the fact that they commit war crimes more than noon and night to achieve their ambitions. Well, you know what? The people of the world are waking up. The people of the world have had enough of them. Politicians have never changed the world, but the people have. And more than ever, I have never seen so many people on the streets as we have in the last couple of years because the establishment has been exposed to what it is. And God help you in the Britain now. He's had, a, he's had to pick between Sunak and, and Starmer. God fucking help us. But, but things can change. We can make the world a better place. We can make, we, we can organize the society where people are treated fairly. We don't have that at the moment. But it's so important that we challenge the system. We cannot be putting up with it. We have to make it plain that the people have had enough of this nonsense. And the freedom of Julian Assange is central to this. If, if No one knows what verdict is going to come out of this trial. We've seen so many at this stage. But at the same time, the, 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 the ICJ in The Hague gave us a verdict that we didn't expect. Let's hope we get another one out of them, please. Thanks.